you wouldn't go to surgery without knowing what's wrong with you, right? That is the same thing as getting your brand redone without having any clue or any understanding of where your business is right now. And this is why it is so important to have a brand power hour session before you do any rebrand. The brand power hour with Boss Diplomat is more than a SWOT analysis. What I mean by that is a strengths, weakness, opportunities and threats analysis looking at your business from a branding perspective. It lays out exactly what is happening in your business right now from a high level brand perspective. There is no point even suggesting what you need in your business when I don't even know what's happening in your business and you're very confused about what you want to do next in your business. What's up bosses? I'm Tarlene Raman Figueroa, your personal brand consultant at Boss Diplomat, making you look so good you can't be ignored. So you have a little bit of a pain in your hand something just doesn't feel right and you go to the doctors you just ask them for surgery like fix my hand something's not working it doesn't work like that with your body imagine your business is your body we have to get under the hood of the business to really find out what's going on kind of like diagnose what the problem is this is why I make all of my clients go through a brand power hour interview. This is a 90 minute intensive session with me. Yes, with me, not a member of my team. I give you my fullest attention and really listen out for what is not being said and how you talk about your business. I'm also looking out for those opportunities that you are clearly missing out on because your brand might be a complete train wreck. I need to be able to figure out where are you in that spectrum? Is it a complete rebrand? Or do we just need to do a little bit of the work up front to get you to the next stage of your business? It's a big difference, guys. It's a big difference between working with me for six months or working with me for three weeks. Another reason why it's so important to have a brand power hour session, just like going to the doctors or getting your teeth checked or any of that stuff, is because you want to make sure that the consultant that you're working with actually has a plan that you agree with. Now, how many times have you heard of a story, or maybe you've gone through this yourself, you told your web designer what you want. You have a vision of what your website is going to be looking like, right? And then six months has gone, or like three weeks or whatever, like some time has passed. They give you the keys to your new digital headquarters. You're like, oh shit, this is not what I expected. That is not what I wanted. They completely misunderstood my vision and values and everything that was in my head, but it was not their fault. It was not the web designer's fault. You just did not communicate that in advance and you did not sit down and talk about what you need, what you want, what your goals are, what you expect the website to do for you, all of that. There's like so much that goes behind the scenes. And if this is unsaid, guess what? Of course, your web designer is not a mind reader. Hello. And that's why something like the brand power hour is important for you to say everything that's on your mind, all of your biggest audacious goals. If you want to be a thought leader, if you want to write a book, if you want to be the next star on TikTok um, as this amazing plumbing guy, like you have to be able to spell this out. Once we have an end goal, we have to work towards that goal, right? We have to set the plan. We have to have a strategy in place for us to be to do that. It's not going to happen overnight. It's going to take some time. And as you, the boss of your business, you need to be able to commit to these goals yourself because no one else is going to do it for you. And this is why having a long-term strategy is so, so important in order to establish your personal brand in your business, in your industry. The other reason why it's so important to have a brand power hour is because hey, you get to test that the consultant that you're working with for a very small price because working with your consultant, i.e. your fairy boss mother right here, could be as much as $25,000 
and you don't want to just spend 25k based on nothing right you want to be able to test out your consultant check out their expertise see if they understand you see if they understand your business see if they understand your industry and see if they accurately read between the lines because if that's my area of specialty you want to be able to take that on a test run and this is the best way to do that last but not least a brand power hour is a test is this going to work out do you like the plan that you're seeing can you see that bigger vision actually coming to fruition can you commit to the time and energy necessary to build that personal brand that you've always dreamt of my recommendation is don't look at the price ignore the price price should not be the defining factor here even though it's going to play some sort of a role because someone can always do something cheaper but cheap does not mean quality what you want to do is test out whether this person is worth every single penny so the best way to check that out is by looking at the website look at the social how present are they in their business and then check out the reviews like do they have any reviews are people raving about them and of course what i mean by that is check out boss diplomat look for me look for me online look for me on google check me out on social like am i legit because that's the same thing that your clients are going to be doing with you are you a legitimate business who will promise what they say they will do and if you can't do that that's what i'm here to fix and that's exactly why your personal brand in your business is so 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 important the other thing to consider is like put a sticky tape on that price and then look at all the deliverables and the timeline how long is going to take for you to do each of those tasks with your consultant can you do it quicker faster and better than your consultant if the answer is no then it's probably best that you hire that individual if you can do it yourself but you know that you will not be able to do it better than them then at least you know that you can come back to them at a later stage because it might be that it will probably take you five to ten years to get to where you want to do it might be that it will take you five to ten years to get to the same place that will take boss diplomat six months to take you to your destination. That's a massive difference. And there's a lot of trial and error that you'll have to do. But with me, it's a science, baby. I've got it nailed down on how to take your brand from zero to hero. If you're interested in doing the brand power hour, before you do that, first get on my calendar and get a free 30 minute mini brand session with me get some tiny time this is another opportunity for you to see whether we will match as potential collaborators